Hi and welcome to another video of SpaceX Update. This morning, Booster 7 was lifted onto the orbital launch mount using the crane. Now, I think SpaceX will be aiming to do some cryo tests before fitting the new Raptor engines. Jared Isaacman, mission commander of the Inspiration4, shared an incredible inside view of the Crew Dragon capsule during a phasing burn. This video is like nothing we have seen in the past, we can actually hear the Draco thrusters. Take a look. Right, as you can see, we are coming up on 15 seconds to our next circularization burn. So right now, we're at 578 kilometers apogee, 370 kilometers perigee. So you can see dragons oriented into the velocity vector. We're at perigee. It's going to burn. It started its burn now. And this is going to lower apogee now to equal perigee, and we'll be circularized around 370 kilometers. You can hear the, the Dracos firing in the background. These are our forward bulkhead Dracos. This is our primary way to create a delta V maneuver. It almost sounds like an orchestra. Thank you, Jared, for sharing. Rocket Lab just launched its second mission of the year, without mission a beat, and successfully placed two Four, Black Sky satellites three, into its targeted two, orbit. One. We have liftoff. While American space companies are starting to thrive, the Russian space agency, Roscosmos, wants to distance away from the US and its partners. Roscosmos chief, Rogozin, in a fresh series of tweets hinted that the international partnership on the ISS with other nations may come to an end. According to the tweets, the reason is due to the failure of its partnering nations to lift the sanctions imposed on Russia, hampering its space activities. He once again said the ISS will die on its own without Russian support and equipment. He also said, the international partnership on the ISS cannot continue, given the present conditions between Russia and the other countries. So he said he will let the Russian government take the decision on the future of its ISS program. If Russia pulls out from the ISS program, will the ISS be decommissioned or continue without Russia? We will find out the answer soon. That's it for now. If you like the content of this channel, please consider subscribing so that you don't miss any SpaceX-related news in the future. See you next time.